What's up everyone? Today we are doing a behind the scenes of how I make my YouTube videos. So let's get started. This is my desk setup where I work on my YouTube videos at. So here we have my MacBook, which I record on. And then there's a the speaker, it's the mouse I don't use. The keyboard I don't use. Here's my Nintendo Switch OLED. Here's the light, and then I have LED lights that are broken. Um, and my monitor. And the earbuds I use. Whenever I'm not using my AirPods, my other phone. And over here we have my iPad, my mini speaker, my MacBook charger when I take it places, and an extra phone case. And there's my iPhone collection of boxes. So yeah, so all I really do, so I normally have my monitor on, and then I have, um, I use this because I need an adapter because there's only two USBs and then a light a headphone jack. So I'll just pl normally plug that one in right here. Okay, it's plugged in now, and I also have this thing, which is connects to this and this, which I both highly dislike. Here I'm logging in the Prodigy and my monitor's just now coming up. Okay, so here we have it, and then it's connected to my MacBook up here. Typically when I play, I drag it up on the other screen. So down here I have all my stuff, and then up here I have Prodigy. As for screen recording, all I do is this. I open up QuickTime Player, which is, I'm pretty sure it's just already in. You'll see it in the corner here, and it's not really an app, but when you click on it, it has all this stuff. It'll show a whole bunch of my other recordings that I've done a while back, plus some of my current ones. So down here, I'll click New Screen Recording. And then we have this. Drag the screen recorder over there and record entire screen. And then we have it. I just have to click anywhere on this screen and then it'll start. Or I can click record right there and then it'll give me a five second timer and then I go from there. I also have these other options and yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so I just finished the video. Once it finishes, it automatically goes onto this one and then it's a, in a video form. It's a three minute video, it was really, really short. And then I gave it a name and then I put it in my videos tag for files so I can find it easily. And where's my mouse at? There it is. So I just named it and put it in my videos tag where all my other videos are. And then I put it on unedited because I haven't edited it yet. So let's get into editing. So my, since my MacBook's old, I'm in the process of opening CapCut. But it takes a while and it sounds like it's about to explode. But that's normal. I just click create a new project. Over here are some of my older videos that I've edited. Up here I have my CapCut. I always need to import three files. One, the video file. Two, the intro and three the outro now i have all three so let's drag them out okay so i dragged out my um main video and outro and normally my intro is in different places depending on how quickly i get into it and if i don't have a good stopping point to and put the intro in i'll just put it in the very beginning so let's me find a place so i decided just to put it at the very beginning because i couldn't find a good spot for it for short videos like these, it needs almost no editing at all. So for this, that's all I needed to do. Now I'm going to export it. Now it's exporting and it's pretty quick because it's a short video. It's all done. Now for the thumbnail, we're on Canva and we got Prodigy down here. So we have the background color. Now I'm going to take a screenshot of this. Taking the screenshot. And now the hats. And it pops up right here. So I just merged the two pictures together and then made them look like one. Although only these four or five were together and then I added these three. Then down here I'll add my wizard without a background. I used a background remover thing to get rid of it. And normally I'll update it but after a couple times of use. And I think I might have dragged this one to the edge because of the wand cut off. Perfect. On the Prodigy Wiki, I'm just going to copy this picture. Here's the final product. Since my MacBook's weird when I um, try to download it, I go to my iPad instead. So here it is on my iPad, so I just go and click Share. Then Save As. And Download. And there it is downloading. 
now it's saving my camera roll and once I upload it, I put it on. Now I've just got to upload and that's it for today. Thanks for watching.